The tracking add-on of Advanced Ads allows you to monitor, report, and share ad slot performance. It gives you insights on the clicks and impressions of your ads. Once you have installed and activated the add-on, visit Advanced Ads Settings page and go to Tracking. And this is where you would configure the tracking method depending on your need. Please take note that there is a limitation if you choose this option to track using Google Analytics, especially the local stats features that are configured in this page. They're not going to work since all numbers will only be tracked using Google Analytics. By default, Advanced Ads will track all your ads performance, but you can configure it later on the second global settings to disable tracking by default, and you can enable it on a per ad unit basis. Here you can set which metric to track. For example, if you want impressions and clicks, don't track anything, impressions only, or clicks only. To enable click tracking, Advanced Ads creates a unique URL, and you can customize this if you'd like. So for example, I'll change this to something like that. And you just need to ensure that this string does not collide with any posts or pages of the same name. Tracking delayed ads here only applies to pop-up and sticky ads using a trigger. So this allows you to get correct statistics of ads that are not showing up immediately after page load. So to enable this, you just go ahead and tick this box. This basically allows you to track ads that are displayed after a specific period of time, for example, or something that would only show up after a certain user action. Some servers might have performance problems or unable to track delayed ads, and this feature takes care of that. To enable or disable tracking in the ad unit level, when you go to Advanced Ads, Ads, create a new one or edit a pre-existing one, you can see Tracking section in there. Then choose whether to enable or disable. To enable click tracking, enter the target URL in here. Please visit Advanced Ads Tracking Add-on documentation to learn more about click target URL. Scroll down to the very bottom. Under Stats, you will see Limits. This feature allows you to limit the number of impressions or clicks that the ad gets before it is disabled automatically. This is very helpful, for example, to prevent accidental clicks or the two-click penalty from Google. If the ad is getting abnormally high number of clicks, for example, then we can set it to expire or be disabled. If you leave these fields empty, then no limits will be imposed. Check the stats. Go to Advanced Ads, Stats. And you should see a graph that looks similar to this clicks, and impressions. You will also have the option to modify the time period, how you would like your report grouped by, and you can also filter by ad. Tracking add-on automatically creates non-indexed public pages with the stats for an individual ad. So when you go inside the ad settings, scroll down to stats, give it a public name, and click shareable link. For more information, please visit Advanced Ads documentation, and here's the link. We're also posting it in the description box below. Thanks for joining us today. We hope you enjoyed our presentation. Also, learn to monetize more by watching our tutorial series and reading our latest ad optimization tips. Please subscribe to our blog to receive periodic updates. Thanks. We'll catch you next time.